This time I'm going to answer another viewer question, and the question is on um, Piano Bar, the command line uh, Pandora client. So, let me show you what the problem is. So, if you run the program Piano Bar, and it gives you a error, right, it tells you to upgrade this um, lib piano thing. Basically, the the problem is that you have an older version that doesn't work no more, and you have to update it. Um, they don't really have a PPA, so you're gonna have to compile it. Um, I don't really like compiling, but since I use this program a lot and I know what to do already, I'll show you how to do it. All right. So when you're compiling anything, um, what you need to do is to install. Show you what you need to install here. Uh, build something. I always forget how you spell that. Let's see here. All right. Uh, you need to install this package. Um, build dash essentials. Whenever you compile anything, you need that program on uh, a Debian base, you know, distro. So install that. You know, do sudo app get install whatever. And the other thing we want to use is git. So forgot the exact package I want, but it's just called git uh, git. And you can use um, or the one I installed. Let me show you here. Is the git core dash core. So install that. Also, um, I think that's the two that you really need. All right. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna find piano bar um, on our search results here. Should be the first one. It should say like um, zoom in here. Right, it says uh, GitHub here. Click on that sucker, and then this is the page. And we zoom in here too. So if you never used this before, uh, well, you don't really have to use, you know, the Git core package. Uh, you can actually download it manually here. It says download, and you have your um, what is it? Download as a zip or tar.gz here. But we're gonna use uh, Git clone for this and this is why they have this link here alright and I'm going to copy that link and now we're going to use it here so you can put in whatever folder you want I'm in my home folder obviously here and what we're going to do is type in git clone and this is going to just download the packages uh, or the files you know from that link so here's the link that we copy it and hit enter And what this is gonna do, list it out, is basically it uh, download the piano bar folder. So let's CD into it, CD into piano bar, and you can list the content, right? And basically these content are the exact same stuff that they have here, right? And that's basically how you use git uh, clone. Um, now that we're in here, now uh, usually you do like dot slash config, but since there's no config file or anything, it's only a make file, right? What you want to do is type make. Pretty simple as that. And we're done with that. And the next thing you want to do is um, sudo check install. And what this command does is it'll make you a dot dev file. So enter and let's say you want to make a package documents. Uh we'll just say yes, why not? Usually when I like build my own packages, um I type in something like this. Alright, we put in the name of it, piano bar, and I always put the build um by me. So that way I can search it, you know, when I'm searching for the packages that I install. Uh, just search my name and then I see what packages I have. Um, so, push enter and enter again. Now in here, you don't have to do anything, but let's say if you did want to do something, you have uh, these options like, you know, 0 to 13. So let's say you want to change um, the maintainer here, alright. Just type in 0. 
and then we'll say uh, we'll, we'll use my email at gmail um, and that's how you would change stuff and, and you can see that it changes to the things that you type in or whatever but really all you gotta do in here is just push enter you don't have to do anything let's see here and now it's gonna build the packages for us the deb so he created a dev file here um, and then it installed it for us already so really it's already installed in our system if you want to search it again so we go search and search for piano bar it should have the package that we just created right and, and this is uh, you know the description that we gave it earlier and this is uh, it's installed right here now if we do let me see here we list out the versions so you can make it sure right so these are all the old versions that is not installed anymore right but this is the version that we just um, compiled ourselves and that's the one that we're using right anyways that's really all you gotta do um, and now if you want to you know run piano bar just type in piano bar and it should play Oop, log in come on <laughs> alright there you go finally it's coming in my internet is slow cause I'm downloading something here but yeah it works here right and then you just type in uh, your station or whatever the hell it is I showed you last time how to use this and it's playing fine so let's quit that now the good thing about using um, git is that in the future let's say um, let's clear this in the future let's say you get the error again you mess it up or whatever um, all you gotta do is CD into the folder which is CD piano bar right and um, what we're gonna do is make sure you clear out your old make so you go make clean and this will clear out you know the ones that we did earlier like the make and all that stuff uh, it will clear it and the next thing you want to do is just type in git pull so you don't have to go you know back in here and do that copy paste the uh, was it the URL here no more you don't have to do that you just have to type in git pull and I was trying to sync it with whatever is on the website uh, if you have like an older version but we're already up to date here so every every file that's in here is uh, current right if it's not then it'll download the, the missing stuff um, and then all you gotta do is you know make it again and then you know after that you do the sudo check install that we did earlier and then you know you compile it again so basically that's all you really gotta do um, when you're ever using uh, you know stuff from git to uh, hub here and that's what I do I, I use this a lot so that's why you know I want people to use it because sometimes you know the the Pandora folks they just uh, update their software or whatever and then you have to use piano bar uh, and it's broken and that's how you would compile like a new version of it anyways if you want to do it there you go right I really don't like compiling but like I said before I use this program a lot and, and that's why I, I compile it whenever it is broken that's it for this one